Is Your Child Safe? With nearly 800,000 missing children reported missing in the United States every single year, and only 2,000 of those children recovered, we had to ask ourselves, are we, as a community, doing enough to help prevent these disappearances? Could we be doing more, and if so, what? Are we doing enough to help recover these children? We set out to investigate. The history of how exploiting these missing children cases came to be is not very hard to find. Between 1979 and 1981, a series of high-profile missing children cases became national headlines. Two of these cases brought shock to the nation, bringing in attention to the seriousness of child victimization and forever changing the response by law enforcement agencies. On May 25, 1979, Aton Pats disappeared from the New York City street on his way home from school. On July 27, 1981, Adam Walsh disappeared from a Florida shopping mall. Hi, I'm John Walsh, host of America's Most Wanted and a friend of the Surviving Parents Coalition. While these two nationally exploited stories made way for the missing children division that we have today, we've still seen an increase in missing children reports, from 150,000 per year in 1980 to over 800,000 now as of 2012. This makes us ask ourselves, are we doing something wrong? Isn't there something more we could be doing? What has created this huge spike of missing children? We set out to investigate.